My name is Malcolm Graham. I'm the CEO of LimeTree. We are a digital marketing agency, and today I'm going to be talking you through some tips and tricks on how to better use the internet and mobile devices. Animation is an extremely detailed topic in which people spend many, many years to learning uh, proper animation. However, you can do some simple animations very easily using the industry standard product, Photoshop. Start by creating a new 250 by 250 pixel image. You do this by going to File and New. Enter 250 into the height and the width. Make sure Pixel is selected. Click OK and your blank canvas should be ready. You can zoom in if you need to. Let's create a simple bouncing ball animation. First, make sure the animation window is open. You can do this by going to Windows and clicking on Animation. Make sure the animation window is in a frame by frame mode by clicking on the button on the bottom right corner of the window. Now we will start the animations. Select the Eclipse tool. Hold down Shift and draw your ball. You can choose any colour you want. Change the delay to 0 0.1 seconds. Click on the arrow below the frame. Now we'll duplicate this frame. This makes the next transition of the animation. You'll see the previous frame has been duplicated. Now move the ball into the new position. In this example, raise it just above the original position. To fill in the gaps in between the two positions, we will use the Tween tool, which is located next to the duplicate frame button. Tweening is the process of creating spaces to fill the gaps in the animation. We will use the following settings. Keep Tween with on previous frame. Change frames to add to five. Select all layers and leave the other settings untouched. Click OK. You should see five new frames added to your animation window. Notice the ball in each window moves up slightly. We will now create the next transition which is going to be the ball moving down. Duplicate the last frame and move the ball down. Perform the tween again with the same settings. Now go to the timeline view of your animation window by clicking on the timeline button at the bottom right of the animation window. Click play. The animation should now start. Now you've created a basic animation in Photoshop. So this is just the very basics of animation in Photoshop. For really um, Proper animations, you do actually need to engage a professional animator to, to help you and they would be able to achieve far more than this simple bouncing ball.